welcome. Today I'm going to be turning a captive ringed goblet and I haven't done one of those for quite a while and I'll be turning it out of this piece of sweet chestnut that was very kindly given to me by my friend Colin King when he came visiting my workshop last year and I haven't actually turned sweet chestnut so I'm looking forward to that. What I intend to do with the finished piece is bring it up to Birmingham to the NEC for Maker Central in May and it'll be put into the prize draw for the charity prize draw that's been organised so some unlucky person has a chance to win one of my captive ringed goblets. What I've done is found the centre of the blank and I have got it between centres and I'm going to turn it to round and I'll be using a spindle roughing gouge for that and then I'm going to turn a tenon on one end and we'll flip it around and put it into the chuck and start to turn. So without further ado let's get turning this captive ringed goblet.
and here's the goblet finished stands at eight inches tall by three inches across the bowl made out of sweet chestnut something as I said I haven't turned before turns very nicely and takes a nice finish thanks for that Colin appreciate it and this little chappy will be going into the charity draw at Mega Central at the NEC in May and if you want to win it buy a ticket I sign the bottom very unprofessionally because my pyrography skills leave an awful lot to be desired nevertheless that's the way it is well thank you very much indeed for watching don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you very soon cheers now